We are gonna try Assassin's Creed Origins on Intel HD graphics and we will see if we can get the best performance out of this really demanding game while also crapifying its visuals in the process. A quick shout out to the guy with the beautiful profile picture for requesting this game and let's begin. For the video, I'm gonna use the built-in Intel HD graphics 630 of my gaming laptop's processor. I initially run the game with the lowest settings allowed by default and 50% of 720p. And while the game was surprisingly playable, there were a lot of drops to even below 15 FPS, especially in intensive areas. In the built-in benchmark mode, the Intel HD 630 scored an average of 18 FPS. Not ideal, you know. So let's get to work! The configuration file for Assassin's Creed Origins is located in Documents Assassin's Creed Origins. The ACO.ini file is the config file. Right click on it and open it with Notepad. Now, you can disable the texture filtering by setting its value to 0, the same thing goes for the bloom, but the value that makes the most difference is the pixel density one, which controls the internal rendering resolution of the game. Even though the lowest that you can go to from the game settings is 50% or 0.5, you can actually lower the value below that with no problems. For example, setting it to 0.25 makes sure it's followed by 3 zeros, lowers the rendering resolution to 25% of 720p, which should give a decent performance boost. If you're brave enough, you can set it to 0.1, make sure it's followed by 4 zeros. This is when you're truly in the most desperate position. If you're not that desperate and you actually value your eyesight, lowering it to 0.25 is the recommended option. After applying the tricks and lowering the resolution scale to 0.25, we saw a noticeable performance boost, especially in those less demanding areas. Sadly, those FPS drops to as low as 15 are still there. In the benchmark mode, we got an improvement from 18 to 20 FPS, which is pretty underwhelming, not gonna lie. So we're definitely hitting that bandwidth limitation of the Intel HD 630 harder and harder. But because we push it to the absolute limits on this channel, I decided to see if the game would work on my low-end laptop with the dual-core Intel Celeron N2840, Intel HD Graphics Page Rail and 4GB of RAM, using a run optimization program called Memory Reduct that I will share in the link in the video description because keep in mind that we only have 4GB of RAM in this case, it's time for the moment of truth. And... No way! It actually opens! It somehow fucking works! By the way, even with the previously mentioned tricks and 10% of 720p, it runs like absolute utter crap! But it's still absolutely insane that this game launches on such a weak PC. So that's it for this video. If you're still here, check out the featured video where I managed to open Assassin's Creed Unity on the exact same potato laptop. Leave a like and subscribe as we're steadily approaching those 1000 subs and I'll catch you guys in the next one.